love these beautiful little spots. You come down to the mountain and you see this. Beautiful. See, it's stuff like this. I don't understand how in the world it got here. Fender of a car. Just out here in the middle of nowhere. I'm probably about 30 miles from the nearest town. No roads. Just a trail. And it's just laying right there. Hmm. So for lunch today, we're going to have some Vienna sausages. Hmm. I got some uh, another, another can, some nuts, some crackers, some pudding cups, these cheese crackers, and some yogurt, or uh, not yogurt, applesauce. So we'll see whatever sounds good. So I hike up the top of this mountain, and I got a gorgeous view up here. Looks like there's some storm clouds rolling in, though. Thanks. Great chance of rain today. Alright guys. See you later. Thank you. Bye bye. On the trail. Check that view. That's beautiful. It's a little lookout spot. I finally climbed top of this mountain. Wind and wind and switchbacks. We finally got up here. So it's got a nice little view once you get up here. Whew. What a climb though. I'm only three tenths away from the shelter where I camp and spot and I'm done for the night. Thank God. All right, I don't know if you can see with the sun right there, but uh, I got uh, 15.7 miles in today. I'm at a place called Ash Gap. Uh, the shelter is 1.9 miles ahead of me, but I've already done 15.7. That's plenty for today. I just want to do 15 a day, so I'm going to call it quits here. Got my tent right there, and... I'm at 361.4 total miles on the trail. So tomorrow we're going to do another 15. And then after that, I should have just in the next day, just like a two or three mile hike into town to resupply. We'll have to hitchhike to get there, obviously. But uh, me and this other guy here, I don't even forget his name, standing here with me. But we got to go up there tomorrow, 1.9 miles of shelter. It's a good climb. And the climb up here was not fun at all, even though I made it up without stopping. Except to just drink some water and look at my phone and see how far I was. But I didn't stop. I made it all the way up without stopping. But I don't know how bad that climb was going to be. If it was anything like the last one, I didn't want to even do it. Like I said, I already had 15 miles. That's more than enough. So I'm going to eat some food, relax, and do nothing. This uh, gap I'm staying at is pretty nice. Let me turn the camera around. It's real nice and green grass. I can turn up go this way. A little fire ring over there if you want to have fire. But I do have water here too, but it's a good hike down the mountain. I already went and got some. And I'm more out from it, so we got plenty for the night. I'll get more in the morning. Okay, so for dinner tonight, I think I'm gonna just gonna do some uh, tuna salad. Eat that. I don't feel like cooking anything. All I have to cook really is mashed potatoes and beef jerky. And I don't really want that. So I'll eat this and some of uh, these cheese crackers and some of these crackers. And then I'll eat some more pudding and Oreos and whatever I can find in here to eat tonight. Eat it up. So that's going to be dinner. It's raining here. And water splashes up from the bottom and gets in here. But look at this. There's hail on the ground. It's hailing. About pea sized hail everywhere. Oh my goodness. Oh. It's going to be a long night. Oh, good morning, everybody. It's morning of the 4th. Oh, we stayed in bed like an extra hour because it rained all night and hailed. Uh, just an awful night. Water got in my tent a little bit, not too bad, but just a little bit. Stayed fairly dry though. So now I got a 1.9 mile climb to get up over Rowan Mountain. Yeah, so I do another 15 today, then I should have just a light day tomorrow into town if I can make it that far. So that's what we're doing. You can see it's 
cold and windy and rainy. The marine jacket on, and we'll try this. Kind of eerie looking up here with all these clouds and fog and stuff. That's just how I'm climbing up and over. Lots of fun. Used to be an old house here at one time, I guess, or something, because here in the middle of nowhere on the trail is the fireplace. That's pretty cool. Wonder who built that. How many people have sat around there during the cold times and warmed themselves? Something to think about. That's pretty cool. Somebody has actually went up here and built a birdhouse on top of this mountain. You see the fog. Rolling up the mountains, the rain and stuff. Over there, sunshine. Three tenths of a mile ahead up here, I'll just give you a better view. Okay, made it to the top. You know, it's real windy. Hopefully, the sun will come out and get rid of all this rain. I don't know if you can see that or not, but that's why I'm fixing to climb. There's a trail that goes all the way up there. That goes down, back up again, go down again to the I don't know how much. Alright, way over there on that mountaintop is where I just was. Climbed all down that and all up here. You can see the sun's trying to come out. But it's trying to stay windy, doesn't know what it wants to do. Hope the sun comes out, warms it up. A little chilly with this wind. Alright, on we go. Great view from up here. I'm going way up top of there. 